This is a quick video that I'm going to record straight off the cuff so forgive me if I make any minor errors or stumble. This is something I've been struggling with. It's actually how to print a booklet from a downloaded user manual. This is my manual here opened in the PDF Adobe format which probably most manuals are these days but I've been struggling trying to get it to print in the correct order on my Epsom single-sided ink jet printer so I will try and help people out a bit here and give you a quick rundown of how I managed to crack it eventually so without further ado we click upon file and print that will then bring up your printer dialog. Here we are, the Epsom stylus. Now this is only a single sided printer, so that means getting the pages in the right order and the right orientation in order to print your pages correctly to produce a booklet. So the first thing we need to do is tell the printer what we want to print, i.e. a booklet. So we will click on booklet and there you go that's your booklet there. We will then in a logical sequence print the front side only. What I want to do here and something I've discovered is a useful way of doing it and a logical way of doing it as far as I'm concerned is to print the last page of the document of the booklet first which means that will be the first page that comes out your last page will be produced first which means that your booklet will then print correctly so that your last page is on the outside of the booklet which is what you want when you turn it around so your last page then becomes the front page. So what we have to do here is to click on this small arrow and effectively reverse the pages. So we want to reverse the pages, we want booklet, we want front side only, we want the amount of sheets which is set automatically and you want your binding to be on the left and you want your orientation to be landscape okay so with that in mind we can go down to our little arrow here and I'll just explain what this means because I was a little confused to start with as to what these numbers exactly meant now page one and three okay that's pretty self-explanatory but what's this little number five in the brackets what I discovered is that number five relates to the page on the right hand side. So the page on the right hand side is page number five. Now the page on the left hand side is not actually mentioned. But that in my case is page number eight. So what we have is a sequence of numbers which would be like so. Number 5 in brackets which is the page on the right means number 8 will be the page on the left. So if we click on to the next one you can see the sequence start to evolve you've got page 3 on the right which means that page 10 would be on the left click again then you'll have page 1 on the right which means your last page page 12 will be on the left so in that case the booklet will print in the correct order meaning the last page printed will be on the top which is what we want 
Now, things get a little bit different when we want to print the other side. So what we have to do is make a mental note of the orientation and which way the top edge of the page came out of the printer. Now in my case, the top edge of the document is always on the left hand side of the printer. If I look at the printer, to my left is always the top of the document. So what we need to do now, once these pages have printed, is to turn them over to the blank side lengthwise. Don't go sideways. You need to rotate them lengthwise in a portrait fashion. So you just flip them over. And what we need to do then, once you've made sure that you flipped your paper over in the correct way, in the portrait fashion, which basically what I'm trying to say here is make sure that your top edge of the page is always on the left. So as long as you keep your top edges to the left, regardless of what side you're printing, keep your top edge of the page to your left, they will print up the correct way. In this case, we need to now print in a different order. So what we have to do would be to print the back side. Now, if you look at it this way, it is now in the incorrect order because the first page that will print will be page 7. The next page that will print will be 9 and 11. So what we have to do here is remove the reverse pages tick which now changes this information here telling us that the first page will be page 11 page 9 page 7 and this relates to page 11 on the right page 2 on the left page 9 on the right and page 4 on the left page 7 on the right page 6 on the left so having done that your booklet will print in the correct sequence and orientation and that pretty much wraps it up this is what you do a quick recap basically here we go quick recap in a nutshell set up your page print your front side only first with the left orientation binding and always make sure you reverse the pages now this is this is the key really this is the, the critical bit left binding front side reverse so front side reverse pages back side don't reverse pages and that'll do you. Hope you found this useful.